This is no place to be right now. So fly away. Good. I'm glad you're able to talk to me. Go! I'll carry you back. Try to hold on. I'll go. The Eldian advance squad has been wiped out. What of the trench? It's hopeless. We can't dig any further. Falco, you look like you're drunk. Guess he must have hit his head pretty good. Who are you people? Where am I? I don't get it. Wasn't I just flying around with a couple of swords in my hands? This war's dragged on for four years now. But with this battle, we can end it. Once those ships are sunk, we'll have won this war for Marley. First of all, you can speak for yourself. Second, they want to judge us. They're choosing their next warrior. The successor to the Armored Titan. <laughs> Shut up. No, you don't. You've made it perfectly clear that you don't think any of us come close to you, Gobby. The difference between me and the three of you is that I'm prepared. Commander McGath, it's coming through now. What is... Sir! They're the Allied Forces' newest weapons, anti-Titan cannons. Line up the Eldians. Have them prepare for a charge. Yes, sir! This is a chance for the 800 Eldians here to atone for the past and serve our motherland with honor. Soldiers at the ready! Up! Prepare to attack! Guard the suicide squad! They'll charge the enemy bunker and disable their machine gun! Prepare to prove your worth! Yes, sir! If you let me, I'm sure that I can take out that armored train by myself. But if I pull this off, you can take out the train without needing to sacrifice that 800-man unit. That said, sir, if you really think I'm more valuable than 800 Eldian infantrymen, I get it. No. Gabby. Mark my words. I'll destroy that train and prove no warrior candidate deserves to inherit the armor more than me. With your permission, I'd like to remove my armband as well. Granted. It's a woman. A girl, really. Who cares? She probably is Eldian. Shoot her before she transforms. Wait for it. Here goes nothing! No! <gasps> Gallard, you're up! <laughs> we should kill every one of you on sight! <laughs> Zeke will be our spear, and Rhyna our shield. You want to outshine the girl who just won this battle for Marley? by being a stickler for the laws of war. Tell him that I managed to stop his bleeding so he doesn't need to be afraid. Do not touch me. I'll be tainted. It's beginning. Still has a number of anti-Titan cannons. I'm sick and tired of all these walls. What the? What hit me?
it's our failure that allowed this war to happen, Reiner. also made it clear to the whole world that the power of Titans would soon be eclipsed. Oh, no. Our soldiers are pulling off. We wasted four years squabbling over some peninsula's sovereignty. The weapons of mankind have at last grown strong enough to sunder Marley's armor. So we can't truly call it a victory for our nation, now can we? Our time's run out. We've been content to rely on the power of the Titans as we expand our colonial holdings. Meanwhile, countries that lack Titans to rely on developed weapons to oppose them. We don't have any Titans with wings, do we? Begging your pardon, General. Ah, Zeke, the boy wonder. Go right ahead. Reforming the army will take time, and the best way to buy that time is by giving the newspapers of the world a new headline to publish, something like this. Marley defeats the Devils of Paradis and seizes the power of all nine Titans. My father, Grisha Jaeger, set something great and terrible in motion on that island, and as his former son, I would like to be the end of it. Your beast is like a second founding titan. What makes you so special, Zeke? It's not like you have royal blood in your veins. The way I wipe my ass, it's real special. Too late. I want a full report. Uh, Commander. Commander! You tell me everything, down to the number of hairs on your ass. So, you believe you can conquer parody in a year? Considering the fact that none of those 32 ships have returned, I think it's clear that we're dealing with more than one titan. Wait! If I had inherited the armored titan nine years ago, then none of this would have happened. An ironically grand name for such a pitiful woman. What did you even do on that island anyway? Stumble around finding people to save you? Yeah. Hawk, we shouldn't pick on people who've been hit by artillery. By the way, Rhyna, you ought to visit Gobby and the others. They're worried about you. Right. Will do. If Titans become obsolete soon, what will that mean for us? Shit! Shit! Udo, Shit! <laughs> Raina! So, you're going to walk again? Yeah. I'm all right. Don't worry. Worry so much. <laughs> Wait! Not the first time I've seen her up there. She'll get the armor. Yeah. The girl who looks up to you more than anyone will inherit your Titan and will die at age 27. If I choose to report this, it'll be you and your family dropped out of an airship as Titans next. Inheriting one of the nine makes you an honorary Marleyan. Surpass Gabi to protect her. Spare her from the dark future we face. Ah, oh, Zeke. Grandpa. Grandma. It's so good to see you. We're so very proud of all your achievements. I'm not done. I'll meet you all in a bit. Ugh, oh, crying out loud. Don't you know how to stand anymore? This is a sorry bunch of Eldians with mental trauma. It's from all that time digging on the front lines. Kaboom! Your armband's on the wrong side. It's okay, sir. I'm sure that you'll get better. Say, Rhyna, not to pry, but I hear you barely escaped from those devils with your life. As you know, I infiltrated their military. During our induction, one devil started eating a potato, but she stole it because it looked good. The time that we spent there was truly hell. 
Hey, good morning. Looks like all of us are here now. Can we all just meet for some tea? The Battle of Fort Slava made it clear the conventional weapons are advancing fast. We'll lose our tactical value as Marley loses her strength. And there is but one solution. Marley must seize the founding titan's power, as well as the resources of Paradis. The world must be reminded of the terrible threat that island poses to us all. The Tiber family will provide one for us. Yeah, but the Tibers have never once used the Warhammer Titan against an enemy state. They're known as the family that drove off King Fritz in the Great Titan War. They aren't hated like most Eldians. If we speak through the Tibers, the world will hear us out. Astute as ever, Peek. You're exactly right. They've never fought for their country or their people. Why should they get to play hero now? But they're... If it saves our motherland, Marley, that's enough for me. Our duty as warriors is to support the Tibers. Well said. Very soon a festival will take place here in Liberio. Foreign dignitaries and VIPs will be invited to hear this announcement from the Tibers. We will conquer Parody Island within the next year. The fates of the Eldian people and of Marley rest on this plan. We cannot let it fail. For the future of our motherland, Marley, we must join our hearts and minds as one. If this is all they're saying in private, I'm not concerned. I just wish Zeke hadn't thrown that comment in. Not here in this room, huh? <laughs> I have to go back to that damn island. We were abandoned. Abandoned by the devils whose blood runs through our veins. And it's why your father isn't here. Your father is Marlion. So it's against the rules for him to be with us. Oh, yeah. Back then, I strove to be a warrior so Mom and I could become Marleyans. Don't you want to become honorary Marleyans? In just a few years, we'll be sent to attack Parody Island. Out of us seven, six will be made warriors at once. No way! Huh? What are you excited for? Are you real strong? Real smart? No. You only made it this far by constantly going on about your love for Marley. Are you seriously insulting our mission? You almost sound like a stray restoration. You traitor! I knew it! I'll report you to the commander for this! Report this? Anyone can whine about how much they hate the island! That's why you'll be doing it here for the next 13 years! Here. I have to become a Marleyan. So I can live with my mom and dad. It isn't gonna be Porco's decision to make. And well, loyalty's more important than he might think. Right, Annie? Huh? Dunno. I was distracted. You get 13 years, and that's it. But I'll be a hero for every one of them. If I can defeat the devils on parody, my parents will be proud to call me son. <sighs> I wish something would happen. Aaron! I finally found you! They're even stronger than expected. The female titan. Its greatest strength is its versatility. Its hardened strikes are incredibly destructive. Leonhard is perfect. The armored titan naturally specializes in defense, as Marley's shield needs to stand tall where the fighting is thickest. It suits Brown's tenacious spirit. The jaw titan is an assault weapon with powerful claws and teeth that can crush almost anything. Marcel's sharp enough to keep up with it. The beast titan is more potent than ever. They can outperform an artillery unit with nothing but a fistful of rock. The cart titan's outstanding endurance makes it well suited for lengthy missions on the field. Peak's superior judgment will serve well here. There's the colossal titan. It is a god of destruction. We trust that Huva can handle it. But why send these children to take the founding titan? Frankly, I think it's a bit insane. We did just watch these children bring a nation to its knees. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out? You're at the bottom. Lina. I'm sorry. It's you, right? My mom used to work at this barracks. Look at my armband. Mom has one too. We're honorary Marleyans. So you're trying to get me hanged, is that it? Well, I'm running away as fast as I can. 
Away from you and your damned Eldian mother! That's right. Even if I don't have a dad, I was chosen to wield the armored titan. We're sure the king won't use the founding titan? What's wrong? Don't tell me you're feeling hesitant to kill these devils. Listen, Rena. The truth of it is, you were never supposed to be chosen. I'm sorry, Rena. Why are you apologizing? Come on. Without Marcel to lead us, this mission's doomed. We've got to continue the mission as planned! What makes you so confident that you two won't get eaten right along with me? But how could someone learn to use it that quickly? You mastered the Colossal on your first try, so you tell me! You think the two of us will be blamed for running after you, huh? <laughs> We're not heroes, dumbass! The Marleans just see us as weapons! <laughs> Stop. Let her go. Our mission is done. We can go home. My father never wanted any part of us. Mom lived for a dream that she knew was hopeless. Before I die, I need to change something! Annie, Bertolt, I'm sorry. I'll be the warrior I should have been. I'm here to save humanity! What happened next is a blur, but I got away on my horse, alone, leaving behind three kids right about your age. Hello there, Missy. You must be a girl of refined taste to take such an interest in this old geezer. She only met my father once, but she described him to me in detail, so that I'd know you when I saw you. I made my sister a promise, so this tale of yours is a joke and a shit one at that. Daddy! Well, damn. Seems you've hit your rebellious phase. Come back! <laughs> but I hit my limit. Almost got caught. They'll be expecting a lot more than a few scraps of information. Yeah, we breach Wall Rose. It also means killing a lot of your friends. I keep telling you, Annie. The cadets aren't our friends. Could you please move your face away from mine? Hey, Ryder. How'd you get so strong? <laughs> keep moving forward. You're able to talk now, huh? Guess that means you're recovering. Minor fake. Huh? Will you report me? No, I wouldn't do that. There's another candidate who's way better than me. So there's no way that I'll be chosen. I'm glad to hear it. Huh? You're a good person. I hope you'll get to live a long life. Every day I've spent here, I've wondered. How did all these people let it come to this? Most of us were pushed. Some of us were pushed by other people. And some of us were pushed by the environments we grew up in. The few who do choose to leap into hell see it differently than the rest. And they're also able to see something beyond the hell. Maybe that something is hope. Or maybe it's just another hell. Fact is, you can only find out by moving forward. Falco, where are you headed this late? I have something at HQ, so I'm running back there to grab it real quick. I want to send a letter, but coming from the internment zone, it'll probably be checked, right? If they see what I wrote, they'll know I shouldn't be here. Would you be willing to send it from outside the internment zone? Hey. 
The Tiber family just arrived. Looks like all of them. I'm Willie, head of the Tibers. It's a pleasure. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. So I'm curious. Can you tell which of us is the Warhammer Titan? Frankly, I'm not even sure if the Warhammer came here with you. <laughs> but no, it is here. Someone among us wields the Warhammer. I came here to lay eyes on the statue of Helos. Truly, this is the spirit of Marley. Yes, I agree with you. Especially since the statue is completely hollow. <laughs> but if I had the ear of the man controlling Marley from the shadows, I would tell him it's too late. <laughs> you truly don't hold back, do you? We intend to reveal everything to the world during the main event of the festival. Good morning, Puck. Hey, Peek. Why are you down there? I guess this just feels more natural to me. Sorry if I scared you. Would you please just walk normal? The Paradis plan seems to be coming right along. Like entrusting the whole operation to four children with no support? Falco just passed Gabi. Look how they celebrate that one win. Falco finally got the best of Gabi! Pretty impressive. It sounds like maybe you're gonna be the next armor. I'm doing this for you! What? Uh -huh. That doesn't make any damn sense! Are they really gonna declare war from here in the internment zone? Sounds like all of Marley's problems are about to magically disappear. And if you two ever cheer for Falco over me again, I will make you cry. It's Commander McGath. No, sir. It belongs to the nation. And Marley is a nation commanded by none other than you, Lord Tiber. It just happened to be me. By sheer chance, I happened to be the man that fate turned to. It's thanks to what you said, Mr. Kruger. I'm gonna keep moving forward. I need to move forward, too. Would you mind if I sit next to you? My name's Jaeger. I'm an internment zone physician. Good to meet you. I'm Kruger. Before the Eldian restorationists were caught, that boy's uncle was a leading member. Hold on. Why tell me all this? So that you'll stop asking that young man to run errands for you. And if your heart and mind truly are healthy, you should go back to your family now. You have regrets about your own family. I was so hard on my son. It's my fault! It's all my fault! Please don't go outside on Super. But I spilled wine on my kimono and was just asking this boy for assistance. There's no telling what they would have done to you if I'd been honest, right? That woman's probably an Easterner from Hizuru. Let me bid you a warm welcome. Yesterday's enemy is today's enemy. Such a refined joke. All right, Willie! These people are known to be descendants of devils, but their ancestors massacred untold millions. Would the world not be better if Titans ceased to exist? There is but one answer to the Eldian question, and tomorrow night I'll share it. Now, to the playwrights and the witnesses of history. To the playwrights and the witnesses of history! What the hell? Gabi! About time you woke up! Why is everything all crazy? And they opened up a bunch of food stalls! Here, try this! <laughs> it hurts. That's what you get for being a glutton. Look at the flags they put up. They should just make every day a festival. Think so, huh? It's probably nothing, but I've noticed a lot of new things have been happening in the last few days. Is that right? It feels strange. As if the world is about to change in a big way. Yeah. I hear you. Hey, how have you enjoyed the festival? Wait, where's Falco? Oh, 
He said he saw someone he knew in the crowd and ran off to say hi. Huh. Hope this doesn't make him late. Man, you really can't loosen up with that booze, can you? Look at all these people. Look there. I guess he made it back. <laughs> Mr. Brown! <laughs> Where the hell have you been? Sir, do you mind coming with me? Don't think there's time. Uh, you'll be fine. The curtains won't go up for a few more minutes. Over this way. What's this about, Falco? You can see for yourself in a second. Hmm. It's through this door. Okay. I got him to come. Evening. It's been four years. Reiner. Keep having this dream. He must have been planning to do it. So why did he tell us his story first? Couldn't say. Doubt we'll ever know. Evening. It's been four years, Rhino. Uh, hey, uh, what's wrong? Mr. Kruger said you were old friends and that he wanted to surprise you. It's true, right? You two were friends? Yeah. And we have a whole lot to catch up on. It can't be. Aaron. Lord Tiber, it's almost time. Thank you. Come to give me a pep talk? I'm sorry to interrupt your preparations. I just wanted to see your face. I'll wish you luck and take my leave. I'm glad you came by. Thanks, Kiyomi. You can hear everything that happens on stage. We're right beneath an apartment building. It's behind the stage, but still. They're all directly above us. Rhina, sit. Just do as he says, all right? Hello. It's been quite a while. Speaking of which, I hear Mr. Hoover died in his sleep, I believe. He did. I'm sure that Annie was just as She's not dead. <gasps> to think, we're about to declare war on what's left of Eldia from the Eldian internment zone. It kind of feels like <laughs> we're the center of the world, doesn't it? The Tibers did this? Can't believe they're this powerful. Falco and Mr. Brown haven't come back yet. Commander Magat sent me. Why, Aaron? Why come here? What do you plan to do? The exact same thing you did. No. I... As for why, that's the same too. I don't have a choice. That's why. Roughly a century ago, the Eldian Empire ruled the world. Humanity as we know it could go extinct three times over. And the body count still wouldn't match the number of lives that Titans have stolen. Such is the legacy of the founder, Emir. So much has been lost. Countless people and cultures wiped out. Once the Eldians ran out of foes to conquer, they began to fight amongst themselves, vying for power. But there was one brilliant Marleyan who saw in this chaos a path to victory. He was the heroic paragon we all know as Helos. Then Helos joined hands with the Tiber family, and they forced the supposedly unbeatable King Fritz to retreat to a far-flung island. With him, he took tens of millions of Titans, ready to trample the world at his command. In order to fight this existential threat, my motherland, Marley, sent a team of four Titan warriors to take the founder. It's clear now, the ancient engine of cruelty called the Eldian Empire is alive and well today. You were on a mission to save the world, right? My orders are to send you to the gate, Jaeger. All right. This way, you two. Where are you stationed? My unit's out west near Lakua. Oh! Peek! <laughs> It's the Panzer unit. Thanks for all your hard work. What are you doing? Let's go. What was that? 
What? Those soldiers ride the car titan into battle. I need their support. Hear anything? Nothing yet, sir. Everything's quiet for now. In here. Go. <laughs> Mr. Kruger said they were old friends, but if it's more than four, then they met on Paradis. Wait, that can't be right. Most of you considered the history I just recounted to be common knowledge. But I stand here now to inform you that it is somewhat divorced from truth. We've passed down memories as well. Truths, which I will now share with you. The savior who ended the fighting, the hero who saved the world, was King Fritz himself. So when he inherited the founding Titan, he plotted his own downfall with the Tibers. Together, we created a Marleyan hero who would drive the king out. He left a warning that if anyone threatened his peace, countless titans would be unleashed in retaliation. King Fritz made a vow renouncing war and bound his successors to uphold it, just as he had. Marley didn't stop Eldia, and chance hasn't kept the world from being crushed. It was the king of the walls, Karl Fritz, a man who yearned for peace. He said that if Marley grew strong someday and came in force to shatter his peace and seize the founding titan, he would accept it. But until then, let me enjoy this walled paradise, free from strife. Though Marley and the Tiber family didn't really save the world? That's well, General, story. your thoughts? Fritz? To secure our own safety, my family joined hands with King Fritz, while our fellow Eldians became devils. But plainly, we Tibers are petty thieves, growing fat on honor we did not earn. Commander! Hmm? The warriors are gone. The hell is this place? Looks like a pit meant to detain warriors like us. What's that soldier's plan? Couldn't tell you. They really were familiar, though. Please stay and watch. This is my atonement. Using a great host of colossal titans. Counted together, the walls surely contain tens of millions of colossal titans. They guard the king's peace as his shield and his spear. An uprising has taken place on Paradis. The king has been deposed, the founding titan stolen. An enemy of peace. His name is Aaron Yeager. But you were just using me. Yeah, I was. I'm sorry. I did it because I needed your help. Until now, only royalty has had the power to wield the founding titan, and King Fritz's vow has kept his descendants from using it. But this Aaron Yeager, has found a way to use the Founder without having royal blood. Once the walls of Paradis begin to walk, there will be nothing we can do. He's exactly right. I'm the bad guy Willie says I am. If nobody stops me, there's a chance that I'll destroy your whole world. And that day, when you breached the wall, when Titans destroyed my home, tell me why my mom was eaten by a Titan. Why did you break the wall? So we could use the chaos to sneak in and to find out if the king would react. If all that was to save the world, then you didn't have much choice. So are you here to make me pay? At first, I considered every person on this side of the sea an enemy. Reiner, I'm the same as you. <laughs> same where I'm from. Inside the walls, we're all just people. Hatred was part of your training. It looks like you've already paid. When the Titan got Marcel, Annie and Bertolt wanted to end the mission right then. I convinced them to keep going because I wanted to become a hero. The, the truth is your mother was eaten by a Titan because of me. I can't take this anymore. Please, just kill me. But if we're to survive this crisis, then for the first time in history, we must join as one. If you wish to live, then lend me your strength. Help me protect our world's future. I was right. I am the same as you. <sighs> I ask each of you to join me as I go to fight the devils who would plunge our world into hell. Help me defeat them! I think maybe we were born this way. Here and now, as a representative of Marley's government, I send this message to the devils of Paradis. I'll just keep moving forward. 
till I killed my enemies. <laughs> Dad needs to get going. I want you to try and stay out of trouble for me. I want to go with you! Uh, yeah, bring us with you! I'm so sorry. But no, I can't. You're making this harder for him. Try and help them to get along. <laughs> Darling. I'm sorry. So if they attack, they'll do it during my speech, yes? But that seems like the strongest possibility. Got it. Seat the officers in a special section, preferably at the edge of the crowd. Is this really what you want to do, sir? We've been at work, fostering relationships with the world's ruling class, and keeping track of the events in Parody Island. Before we knew it, our enemies had crossed the sea. As you surely know, our motherland Marley has many enemies even within our own military. We know when and where the foe intends to attack us. That ought to give us the advantage. Even if we can't predict their moves, we're putting far too much at stake. We're sacrificing incompetent officers. So many will die. And most will be Eldian civilians. They're the spawn of the devil, aren't they? You've ordered countless Eldians up and over to meet their deaths, so these ones won't be wearing uniforms. That changes nothing. This is no war. We don't know our enemies, their goals, or how they plan to attack us. If we go forward with this, and use you to bait the enemy, I doubt I'll be able to protect you. Unless I stand on that stage, the world will not take notice. As victims of an unforeseen attack, if I escaped while my people died en masse, the world would not rally to our cause. Then we're devils ourselves. to be the usurper of the founding titan down there. the tremors. I think Titans must be fighting on the surface. The hell? You're late! Back then? There's something up with this soldier. Huh? What the? If we kill the Founder, it will only postpone the problem. That's him, Aaron Yeager. Usurper, Aaron Yeager. Before you die, 
You may own your final words. It's time, Mikasa. Glad to see that all of you made it. Please, Aaron, come home. Don't let a single island devil escape, especially not the founder! This has gone exactly as Willie planned. The entire world now considers the Eldian Empire a threat. We need to try to keep civilian casualties to a minimum. Everyone here is an enemy. Seriously, you have to stop thinking like that. Look there. Huh? He's telling us something that we have to fight. Hey, Aaron. You understand what you've done. It's not over, Mikasa. I blew up the nape of its neck. And I crushed its nape with all my strength. <laughs> I think I get it now. The Warhammer Titan uses hardening to make whatever it needs. If this works, I'll be able to eat the Warhammer. You should go find your family. Wait! It's not safe! Gabi! Start running and turn! Son of a- Let's go, Sasha. Slow down. You forgot that we need to set a lamp out, Connie. I knew that something was off. There was something abnormal about the way the Warhammer materialized. It was the first time I'd seen a Titan form from the feet up. So that's where its body is. I'm taking the Falcon right now! Could that be him? Is that Ackerman? Can't you see I'm a titan? Are a bunch of humans really about to come and kill me? No, they're not humans. They're devils. I'm taking the founder right now! Be him? Is that Ackerman? Are a bunch of humans really about to come and kill me? Behind us! Hold back! Take cover! The Cart Titan's here. Pink! Stay alive. That's an order! Mr. Kruger? No, it's Aaron Yeager. Vice Chief, I'm sorry. It's all my fault. But he's unconscious. His body should be healing itself with the power of the Titans. I can't.
can't take this anymore. Please just kill me. Sit tight, sir. I'll get help. That bastard's gonna pay! Wait! Get back! I'll kill him here and now! Bad angle! Stay on your toes! I ran into Ackerman a minute ago. He's still hiding nearby. But I know that you've spent the last of your strength. If you had any left, you would have used the Warhammer's power to pierce my neck by now. It looks like I've outlasted you. The bastard still has more fight in him? We have control of the battlefield and its surroundings. And the incoming Marleyan reinforcements have already surrounded the zone. Paradine never stood a chance against Marley in a proper war anyway. For the time being at least, focus on protecting the war chief from Ackerman. Let's have a rematch, Levi. Come on, show yourself. You're running out of time, right? We need to reinforce the troops in Liberia quickly! Hey! Huh? is the power of the jaw. Listen. I'm sorry, but I feel like maybe we should let Rhina sit this one out. That's a relief. At least we know that some of the mission went according to plan. Well, we're counting on you, Onyan Capone. So any stragglers who miss us are out of luck. What, you get possessed by Ervin's ghost or something? This has to work, because if we lose Aaron and the others, then we have no future in this world.
Help! Rats! The enemy soldiers will hear you! Stop! Why won't any of you? Seems to me this fight's over. As for Reina, I can't exactly kill him at this point. See you later, Reina. <laughs> Looks like they're retreating. They're getting away. Aaron Yeager! Gummy! I'll shoot you down! Captain Levi. You have a real kickable face, you know that? I'd like to have a longer chat. But I explained everything in the letters I wrote. Did you not understand them? I know that face. I used to see it on the rotten shits I met in the underground. Everything went just like you wanted. Jean! You go in too. Our people don't need the garrison anymore! Jean! Grab on! Thanks, you two! Who's left? But assuming that all of them make it back, we've lost six soldiers. That's nothing compared to the damage we did to the enemy. Good work, soldiers! I wonder how many more we'll have to fight. Honestly, I'm just glad that we made it. But you guys will always be special. To me. That hurts, dumbass. Don't hug us while you've got all that metal on. Gummy! There's no point in chasing them. Even you know that. Sophia was right next to me talking. Udo tried to get it off her, but they stepped on his head again and again. I ran into those gate guards we talked to. Now they're dead. I saw some woman shoot them from a rooftop. Because I'm an Aldean, people spit at the sight of me walking around. I'm fighting to show the world that the Aldeans here are good people. So if somebody tramples it, I'm not gonna forgive them. Mr. Zeke was killed right in front of us. Tell me why my mom was eaten by a titan. Their home was trampled too. This is just revenge. It doesn't matter. They're savage and cruel, and whatever we might have done to them, it wasn't half as bad as what they deserved. Reiner, I'm the same as you. <laughs> <laughs> It's just a kid! The line... It's still attached. Hold on. You want to go up? Talk to my mom and dad for me. Tell them that I fought my hardest to the end. All of you will carry my spirit forward, right? Surpass Gabi to protect her. Falco! Because I'm the one who should inherit the armored titan! Hey, Lobov isn't back yet. <laughs> Sasha! Fight us 
some bandages. Hurry! Right. Come on, just hang in there. I'll toss him outside. Hey, Peek. <clears throat> Commander, I know that Marley and Salter. It was about three years ago, during an inspection of the first survey fleet to go to Paradis. The scout ships that disappeared? Hey, how long are you gonna make me look at that thing? You might have killed Zeke, but not his spirit! Ice true Eldians are gonna haunt you till you're all rotting in the ground! How are you able to recognize them? Because she's a devout follower of Zeke Yeager. We thought that you were dead. They took you alive? They somehow killed Lobov. This one shot Sasha. I don't think she's gonna make it. <laughs> well, Zeke, it seems everything's played out just like you wanted. Huh? Wait, who are these kids? Miscalculations. Well done. Oh, please don't glare, Levi. You don't want to make me piss my pants, do you? I'm the kind of person who saves the best bite for the end of my meal. Every single time you get yourself caught, we give up lives to get you back. Held yourself hostage to force our hand. You put your trust in us, and we've lost our trust in you, Aaron. You now possess the Founding Titan as well as a Titan with royal blood. Eldia will be free. It's Sasha. She just died. Did Sasha leave you any last words? She asked for some meat. <laughs> Sasha only died because you dragged the scouts into this. You know that? Fuck. <laughs>